Oh, hey guys, how's it going? Uh, yeah, we're gonna put an aluminum radiator on the 55 truck. So uh, let me show you what we got going here. We, I'm gonna go with a mechanical fan. So uh, the only way I could get this uh, fan shroud that fits the radiator good was this flange was on the top. It always seemed like all the ones I saw, this flange was on the long way. Well, I need to uh, mount it on the side here. So I'm going to take some of this. Uh, this is like a 18 gauge, and I'm just going to break it at this angle. Um, I have my little this little angle finder right here that I can bend it till I get the angle and that should fit nice. So we'll go ahead and uh, bend that up. And uh, oh, and uh, also uh, I got the drive shaft back. There's the drive shaft right there. So ready to go back in the 55. Uh, got that done from Drive Lines Northwest. These guys right there. And uh, also I uh, got a sticker. I wanted to show the sticker I got. Uh, J Ride Customs, Jason over there, Canadian guy, does really nice work. Go check his channel out. Okay, so let's get to uh, bending a piece of this over in the brake. Look at that, right on the money. Very nice. This side's up a little bit, but that's okay. We only need 15 inches of it. So we'll go ahead and mark that. We'll go ahead and cut back uh, about an inch right here. So we'll tuck it up inside and I'll bring you guys back in a little bit here. All right, so we got this guy uh, bent up. I cut, cut it back about an inch. And what I want to do with this is go ahead and stick this this flange up into the back side of it so we'll set that up inside the back like that and then that should give us our our little flange right there for bolting onto the radiator so that that's good we like yeah. that it uh, clamped to the uh, shroud here so I'm going to go ahead and drill through these holes through the shroud then I can uh, mount it up i won't permanently mount it because i want to make the holes on uh, the radiator from the back side of this flange and then i can uh, nylock this down with quarter inch when i'm all done and then it'll be uh, ready to go on the radiator once the holes are made there okay i'll bring you back as soon as i get both sides done here so here's the radiator and here's my shroud with the uh I just have them, uh, eventually they'll get a uh, nylock in here, but right now I just wanted to set this on there to get my marks up through there. That seems to fit pretty nicely there, so that should work out pretty good. And I'm just going to put some, uh, I'll put some weather stripping on here uh, so it'll pull it off of here a little bit and it'll help to seal this bottom is eh, right now in the bottom here it's touching the weld so there's no uh real uh yeah th yeah that fits nice i like that right there i'm on the weld up here i'm right on the weld too so that's that's centered real nice right there so yeah we're gonna make our we're gonna call that good right there wanted to get the holes up in here uh, right on so uh, I cut a felt marker down short and believe it or not it's just filled it won't even leak so it's nice so I could get inside of here and get a nice straight on hole so now I'll take this off and make these uh, final holes here Alright, so here's our uh, foam that's going to go between here 
I got this stuck down. So I'm going to put the radiator and the shroud together one time, but then I'll be pulling them apart until I actually, uh, you know, take it over to the truck. But I just want to make sure everything fits good. So I'll bring it right the back. finished product. The only thing I did is I wanted to tuck this underneath here, but because of running the, uh, the three eighths bolts, it just turned out better to have it on the other side so I could center this in there. The other ones were five sixteenths. They had been okay, but they were in here. I just like this a little better. So anyways, there's the final of uh, this and I think it looks good so I can take it over and, you know, mark where my fan's going to be and then uh, finish the rest of it. So well, I just uh, want to thank you guys for uh, coming by and we'll catch you on the next one.